If you've watched my previous video about dealing with emotions as a man, you would have heard that I'm going through an emotionally challenging time. And I'm not gonna lie to you, it has been tough. The last three days I haven't eaten half as much as I should have. I've been slacking. I've been a weak man. This morning I woke up at about 5.30 and I didn't get up straight away. I lay in bed for two hours bathing in my own self-pity. I had such a negative mindset. But then I started thinking about my purpose, the mission at hand, all the goals that I have to achieve. As a man, the harsh reality is no one is going to save or help you. You have to work to achieve your own goals. If you're in a poor mood, you have to take the initiative and be active. You have to do the good habits. You have to push even though you may be hurting. If you're in an emotionally vulnerable place, the first thing in the morning, you have to push yourself out of bed. You have to motivate yourself. The only way you can do this is by reminding yourself about your mission at hand. Whether it's finishing your degree, whether it's starting your business, building your dream physique, you have to keep that in mind. You have to remember what's more important than your negative emotions. You have to think about the vision that you have for your life, the purpose that you so desperately need to fulfill. But the only way that this can motivate you is if your purpose is bigger than your emotions. If your purpose is like a magnet that you're attracted to every single day. Only when your purpose is so important that you learn to go on with the mission, even if it hurts. That's when you learn how to work despite your conflicting emotions. It's when you learn to live amidst great pain. As a man, you have to live with an open heart, even if it hurts. There's really no other way to live. This is a superior way to live your life. This is the way of a superior man.